Hello, Jason Heath, X Plane 11 here with another video. So apparently, I have never had any time to upload any uh, any new videos so far for a long time. And again, uh, thank you for watching my uh, my uh, live stream. If you uh, did not see it, if you didn't see it, thank you for watching it. I really do appreciate that. So before I get started in the video, sorry, just for a minute, I just got to make sure the video is yes, okay. I'm going to change the settings of the simulator for just for a second. Okay, it's been changed. Now that it's been changed, I can go ahead and... Hopefully this will make the plane be able to do it. Okay. So in this video today, I'm going to show you the max altitude for the Challenger 3 business jet, uh, the Challenger 300, uh, uh, Challenger 300, uh, business jet. This plane, believe it or not, can reach a very high altitude. Regular that it's not usual as a regular uh, airliner can. This this uh, business jet or this uh, plane can reach an altitude of of 45,000 feet. So I'm gonna go ahead and go gonna go ahead and climb to its max out. Make the plane do its max altitude. It's the max altitude it can go. Once the plane goes up to that altitude, then it can't go any higher. And like I said, um, only certain types of planes, or certain, only certain types of planes, are able to, uh, however, do this. Not all of them can. The yeah, only specific types of planes, such as this plane, can actually go up to climb up to 45,000 feet, which is very, very high. In fact, if you were up at this altitude. You'd only have like a few seconds of consciousness left because there's not very much out. There's not very much. There's probably not very much oxygen up there, by the way, if you may not know. And it's, it would make you get sick. Make you sick and get. You would be. You'd have epoxia if you were not careful. Totally. Okay, I'm going to clear this out. And I'm going to do this. And then, done. All right, everything is ready to go. Um, this plane has been having some a little bit of some issues, unfortunately. So, you won't be able to hear the engines on this in this video, unfortunately. You won't be able to hear the sound of the engines in the simulator, unfortunately. But it's what it's gonna be. That's the way I'm gonna film it. I'm th I mean, this is the way this video is gonna be technically. All right, here I go. Eventually the plane will have to, this climb may, will take, might take a long time, so sit tight right after it, the plane takes off. And by the way, also before, right after takeoff, the plane will turn to a heading of 270 after takeoff. I am setting the, the heading now. Okay, 120 knots. Rotate, here I go. Woo! Flaps up. All oh, right, heading to seven zero. Here it goes. Sorry about that. I'm going to set my 
my laptop for delay performance. Okay. All right, so as soon as the plane reaches 37,000 feet, the plane might go over the salt flats eventually. Just letting you know, it, it, it will do that probably. It'll, it's going to do that. Just letting you know it will. All right, everyone. All right, the plane is plast one zero thousand. It's gonna take a very long time, so just hold and just hold tight for a while. All right. One two thousand. As soon as the plane reaches that altitude then it'll be done and that's the highest this plane is gonna do that's the highest it can go alright thirteen thousand one three thousand one four thousand one five thousand plane is maintaining the altitude. Hopefully by the time the plane reaches 39, I mean uh, 45,000 feet, it'll be over the salt flats uh, as expected. Alright, the plane is doing well so far. everyone all right one eight thousand one nine thousand Twenty thousand feet. FPS is going well so far. Good. Twenty one thousand feet. Everything is going well so far. Twenty Two thousand feet, twenty three thousand feet, climbing well so far. This climb may this climb will take a long time, just letting you know perhaps. Alright everyone,
Thank you, everyone. All right, twenty-five or approaching twenty-five thousand feet. Pay attention to the altimeter right here. I'm switching over to HUD now. As the plane begins, the as the plane climbs. This climb will take a long time, 25,000 feet. Everything is is going well so far. Twenty six thousand feet, twenty seven thousand feet, everything is going well. Pretty soon, Twenty coming up on twenty twenty eight thousand feet. Everything is going well so far, it looks like. Okay. Coming up on twenty nine thousand feet and then thirty thousand feet and then forty then 44,000 feet and then it'll be to the plane should be in its max altitude my guess is in uh is in I'm timing it right now no no I'm not <laughs> um yeah yeah so so far it's been climbing for like more than okay Thirty thousand feet. Everything is going well or as expected. Hopefully the plane will be able to reach its the altitude. Hopefully the autopilot will help the plane reach its max altitude, which I'm gonna show you right eventually once it reaches the altitude. Thirty coming up on thirty one thousand feet and then thirty two thousand feet. Alright. The the point the point that 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 the plane needs to go is needs the plane needs to go at least forty four thousand feet in order to reach forty forty five thousand feet. It needs to go up to forty four thousand feet, which is very high totally. Thirty one thousand feet going well. I am going to switch over to the cockpit view. Thirty two thousand feet. Coming up at thirty three thousand feet, waiting until forty thousand feet. The yeah, thirty two thousand feet, coming up at thirty two thousand feet. Everything seems to be going well so far. Thirty three thousand feet. Ready to go. The plane is pass should pass over the salt flats now. Okay. Forty f coming up on forty. F 
43,000 feet. Okay, 43,000 feet coming up at 45, 45,000 feet coming up. Forty five thousand feet. Switching back to cockpit view. My cold. This plane is okay, thirty six thousand feet. Approaching 36,000 feet, the plane will hopefully reach the altitude. Okay, the plane has been climbing for more than for more than 10 minutes, probably. Thirty-six thousand feet. One thousand. 1,000 feet per minute climb rate. Oh, Mach. Mach was disenga was engaged accidentally. So hold on a minute while I change it. Okay. 215 for a climb. thirty seven thousand feet my favorite cruising altitude like usual I like it I do just to remind you okay thirty seven thousand feet everything is going well so far in the climb Alright, everything is going well. If my the plane says I've been flying for eighteen minutes. It should say how long it would take to fly all day over to forty five thousand feet. Thirty eight thousand feet coming up on forty thousand feet in a few minutes. Speed change of climb two hundred sixteen knots. Okay, thirty eight thousand feet. Thirty-eight thousand feet. Come up on thirty-nine thousand feet. Thirty-nine thousand feet. Halfway there. Climbing well so far. Nine thousand climb rate. Coming up on forty thousand feet in a few minutes.
coming up on 40,000 feet. 40,000 feet. Halfway there. Okay, everything seems to be going well so far. Coming up on 41,000 feet and then 44,000 feet and then this will be the max altitude this supply can go, like I said before. Almost there. Forty one thousand feet approaching forty one thousand feet. All right, forty one thousand feet. Play needs to climb to forty four thousand feet, and then it'll be there. And that'll be the max altitude this plane can go, and that'll be the end. Max altitude this plane can go. Okay, 41,000 feet. Everything is going well so far. Come on. If the plane loses too much VD vertical speed at, loses too much climb rate, I will climb, make, force the plane to climb to the altitude with a little bit of vertical speed through autopilot and disengage. Flight level change the, the, mode on the autopilot I will, I will change it okay 42 approaching 42,000 feet in a few minutes coming up on 42,000 feet halfway there come on all right. 42,000 feet. All right, 42,000 feet. The plane should be at 40 43,000 feet in a few minutes and then 44,000 feet and then it'll almost be there and then it'll be there 42,000 feet okay okay Approaching 43,000 feet in a few minutes. Okay, 44, 43,000 feet. Halfway there. Okay, so as the plane climbs, it's going, the altitude is going to. the plane's vertical speed to will decrease because it's technically um, getting less getting less uh, the atmosphere will be less the all right the plane will go into Nevada for 44,000 feet then it'll be on its way and it'll be all the way back home be at 44,000 feet. 
I mean, 45,000 feet. <laughs> yeah. Okay, halfway there. Forty-four thousand feet, standing by for forty-four thousand feet, and then forty-five thousand feet, and then it will be there. Approaching forty-four thousand feet, and then forty-five thousand feet, and it'll be its max altitude, or flight level four five zero. Alright, 44,000 feet. That's high. Haha. <laughs> Almost there. Ugh. Alright, the plane's almost there. Standing by for 44, 45,000 feet. The max this altitude can this, the max this plane can go. Alright, come on. Alright. Forty four, forty nine, 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 forty, forty four, forty four, four. Okay, almost there. Ugh. Okay, almost there. Almost there. All right. Vertical speed is decreasing as the plane climbs. Approaching 45,000 feet and... Auto throttle engaged. B215 at 45,000 feet. All right, everyone. All right, everyone. So the plane's not at 44. 45,000 feet just yet. The reason why it's not is because the VS has not gone down yet. Okay, there it is. Almost there in just a few minutes. My calculation is correct. The VS is just not at zero just yet. Vertical speed is not at zero. Okay, the plane is still accelerating at 44,000 to 215 knots, so you really can't see it though, but that number, that 5 right there is just, is still moving right now. It's moving over ever so slightly. Alright, the VS is not at zero, but 
Hmm. All right. All right, everyone. All right. All right. The plane is successfully flown. The plane has successfully reached its max altitude of 45,000 feet. Regular, regular, even higher than, than a regular business, than a, I mean, regular, reg, much higher than a, way much higher than a regular airliner plane can do, like I said. But yeah, this is as high as this plane can go, technically. This is as high as it can go. What's saying that, what, what's saying that this is the highest it can go. But only, like I said in the beginning of this video, only uh, specific types of planes are able to do this. So, just making sure you can understand that, that it just, only specific types of planes can only do this. With that said, um, enjoy the view for a few minutes at 45,000 feet. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Oh, also one more thing too. Um, I'm really hoping to upload more videos, but I'm going to be busy with school eventually. So if you want to see more videos, the only thing I'd ask you really technically is just be patient. Unfortunately, a long time ago, I'm, I, uh, I lost a subscriber. I had 32 subscribers and I have 36. So yeah, like I said before, I'm so glad that anyone else was able to watch my live stream, my stream before Christmas of Christmas 2021 on December 18th, 2021. If you still want to watch it, you still can. With that said, thank you for watching my video. Bye bye Uh-oh.